What's going on everybody? Eric here coming to you from Orlando. Yeah, mixing things up a little bit. I am still at Daytona International Speedway. Got my infield wristband, but uh, as you can see, we're over here at uh, Sick World Speedway in Orlando for Sick Week. They're gonna be doing some drag racing right here. There's a couple different bleachers we can go sit at, hanging out with my buddy Robert hey. and Jasmine the dog. Come join me, let's go see some fast cars. This kicks off in about 15 minutes or so, and then we're gonna be, have to head back because there's another race there at the track, and I've got a special, special front row seat for tonight's truck series race. It's gonna be fun, but uh, thanks for joining me, guys. I will be uploading this video with some Nomad internet. Link below in the video description for high-speed, unlimited, unthrottled, awesome internet. Gonna see if we can find a way to the other side of the track looks like they got some refreshments and maybe some merch stands so we're gonna go see how you get over there well i got a souvenir t-shirt and uh looking at this honda civic and boosted boys it has a few uh youtube channels here that's cool there's definitely a lot of fun cars to look at and it's cool because all the little small mom and pop teams here you know they're really sociable they'll they'll talk to you you can find out more about their cars they got a they got a general lee here <laughs> love that color the 01 yep but is the diesel here we got to be getting back to uh the racetrack for tonight's race so we're gonna start heading that way soon hey y'all welcome back to the channel Oops, of course I have it. Hey, we're, we're back. We're back in Daytona here at the Fan Zone. We got a special treat today, guys. I'm gonna take you guys in. I've never been to the pits, but uh, Spire Motorsports reached out and gave Robert and I both free garage passes for the truck series, the Craftsman Truck Series tonight. So we're getting in here a couple hours early, gonna get our VIP credentials and uh, get to get a little bit different perspective of NASCAR. Let's come on in with us. All right, got our VIP uh, passes here, and we are here in the garage area, working on the trucks about one hour until practice officially starts. Heck yeah. So here's the uh, side of the Spire Motorsports number seven, Corey LaJoy's uh, garage truck here. Here's the fuel cans, which are just about as tall as I am. And then there's the inside of the garage area there. They're working on some tires over here, brand new Goodyears, yep. And everybody just getting some last minute stuff together in here. It's pretty cool. A lot of business going on here though too. It's way different than the NASCAR Cup garage, you know? It's out here in the open. Wow, uh, Team 30 here is swapping an engine. Look, the engine's on, literally on the ground and they're taking it out or putting that one in or something. That's crazy love these trucks they're just as fast as the regular stock cars on sunday but totally different sport oh there's no passenger seat <laughs> pretty cool the sun's just setting and it's cooling off i never knew that that's how they put those trucks in there on the top like that never would have known that <laughs> it's funny and then running out of time over here they're lifting the engine to put it in that car over there Number 30 is going to have a brand new engine here for the race. All right, there goes Corey's mobile garage off to the pits. Number seven, lucky number seven. Go get him. So 
this is another cool view to watch the race up here on the fan deck and fan zone, but we have grid access, which will get us onto the pits. That's where we're heading next. All right, guys, we are in the pits. Uh, can you believe this? Oh, this is so cool. Man, I can't wait. Pit road, guys. All the little chunks of rubber all over the place. <laughs> oh man. There's Eric Amarola. Oh my gosh. Yeah. All right, here we go. The Spire Motorsports uh, pit area here. Down here on the track now, getting ready for free race festivities. There's uh, Corey's truck there, number seven. Heck yeah. Getting ready here. Starting fifth. Number seven. Woo! Corey! There's Corey LaJoy right there being interviewed live. Right there on the TV. Heck yeah. <laughs> Go get him, Corey. Fox filming right here. That's so cool. Corey's family. Man, this is up close. This is so cool. Wow. Pretty cool. What a fanfare here. All right, time to race. We're going back to the pits. Drivers, stop! Of the night, yeah, and they fire. were getting after it in the middle of the pack. Yeah. Rick Clay Greenfield gets turned around coming through the track. Uh oh, <laughs> it just started pouring in Daytona. Oh, they're gonna kick me out of here. <laughs> oh no. Oh well, we'll get back to racing here. This is still literally the best racing experience ever in my entire life. Just is so cool being down there. I'm up here at Fan Zone waiting on Robert. He wants to go check on his dog back at camp in the van. So um, yeah, I got a, I got me a bush beer here at Fan Zone, and I can keep an eye. Head back. It looks really misty and foggy. It's very humid. Obviously, it was raining, and it's still kind of warm. Clear. Yeah. All right, the cars are back on the track. It's dry. We'll see how this works. We're getting ready to go back to green here. 22 laps done. No, 33 laps done of 100, but I'm going to try something new. There we go. We're back to green flag racing here. Nice big uh, screen. It looks a lot clearer to me than it does on your video. They're uh, coming on the back stretch. Let me see, they're coming around turn three right now. I'm gonna pan over here, look at the track as they come around four. Straight, over, straight ahead, into the front stretch. We lose them with the big haulers. Yeah, oh my gosh. Last lap of stage two and another wreck. He checked on his dog, checked on the kitties. Everybody's good. Uh, we're going to just kind of hang out here until the end. I will just mention Corey. I didn't film it, but Corey got stuck in the middle and everybody was zooming. He's like 14th or 15th now. See how it goes. We're under another rain delay. It's our fifth rain delay now. Yeah. I think I need a little snacky poo, though. Some nachos. Yeah. 
All right, little update. After about a 40 minute delay, we are now under a red flag for rain. It is raining heavy in Daytona and everybody's coming to the few little spots of uh, no rain and it's also very humid. So yeah, we're, we're snacking. It's also last call. We got, we got a long walk back to the RV, but that's it. Um, we'll see. We'll see if we're gonna finish this race or not tonight. It's still rain heavy. Hopefully it's a short ride. Yeah. Oh yeah, they got those little tour trams maybe. Okay. Well, a lot of people have left for the night. Just looking to see if they're gonna be able to dry the track and finish these last 20 some laps. Don't know. We'll see. Well, we came back to camp here at the RV. I don't think a lot of people have stayed up. We're, we're gonna try to stay up and finish this one. Maybe not today. It's 10.40 p.m. They're still drying the tracks. Red flag. But we're going back. So oh, it's gonna go. Yeah. We're gonna drink some beers, walk back over, and definitely finish this race. Either tonight or early tomorrow. over here we got here they just canceled the race they uh they're giving it to zane smith at like 80 something laps they're gonna 79 laps they're gonna call it so zane smith wins we're not gonna finish it we'll try again tomorrow i gotta get some sleep we got two more races coming tomorrow and then the big daytona 500 see you in a few days guys bye, -bye. don't forget check your off always did you know that there is a sunoco gas station for the race cars here in the infield Let's check the price here real quick. $8.70 a gallon. 98 octane. Wow. <laughs> Okie dokie, fill her up, Chuck. Oh, 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 oh.